Welcome to MLAC online tutorial before us in this question in chemistry that says what mass of copper could be deposited when 2 ampere of electric current is passed through a solution of copper 2 sulfate. Here is the symbol for the compound for 30 minutes and we are given that the relative atomic mass of copper is 63.5 and one faraday of electricity is given as a 96,500 coulomb per mole okay now first and first is to write out the uh, the equation that took place in the negative uh, electrode which is the uh, cathode the cathodic half uh, equation now which is given as this copper in the cure solution gave out uh, each electron two electrons now to be deposited at the cathode so which implies these two electrons implies two for a day now and what not it means two for a day they actually deposited one more of uh, six 3.5 gram of copper okay so in essence so you can see here that 2 times 9 6 5 0 0 column of electricity deposited 6 3.5 gram okay now if this deposited this all right so in essence now let us now Calculate the quantity of electricity for this uh, expression. So here we have that following the first law of Faraday of electricity, quantity of electricity equals to what the current, the product of the current times the time. Now this will give us two, the time which is thirty minutes. Now we have to convert it to seconds, which means we are multiplying by sixty. And this will give us 60 times 60, which means 3 times 30 will give us 60. And this will in a place give us 6 times 6 is 36. Then how many zeros? 1, 2, 1, 2. Okay? Okay. Alright. Now, if this column could give this, now what mass of copper will be deposited with this quantity of electricity? So as such now, let us equate 2 times 96500 gave 63.5, deposited this. So what mass of copper will 3600 deposit, which is X. Alright, now let us cross multiply. By cross multiply means this will be multiply by this and this we multiply by this so here we have that x times the whole of this will now give us one nine three zero 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 okay now and the whole of this also will give us uh, six three point five times three six zero zero right so in essence making x is the formula it means we have got to divide this by this with the coefficient of x here so here you have that x will now be 63.5 times 300 over 193000 0 cancel 0 0 cancel 0 all right by punching our calculator we should be left with a 1.20 gram of copper okay this is the final answer and if you love what i've just done please kindly subscribe to my youtube channel and i'm sure you click on the notification button to be notified of every video that i'll be uploading both in physics chemistry and mathematics thank you and god bless you